Welcome to my first New York City vlog. My name is Alicia and I moved to the city around April 2022. Um, living in the city, there's like so much happening at all times. So I thought I'd take you through a weekend of my life. All the action usually happens on weekends because like weekdays are so busy um, with work. I feel like a lot of my friends back home are always watching my stories and always wondering, you know, what I'm up to here. So here you go. Hope you enjoy. I just brought home some extra Naya that we had. This is our dinner. Are you happy I brought this home for you? Yeah, I'm supposed to be eating more Mediterranean food. Why? I have high cholesterol. Oh, right. Wait, does that help with your diet? Mm -hmm. Really? Apparently. I have a potluck thing at my work tomorrow, so I signed up on our Google spreadsheet that I was going to bring a charcuterie board. So I got to go to Trader Joe's later to just go pick up some charcuterie stuff. So I have a checklist of things that I want to buy for the charcuterie board. Pretty basic stuff. Are you coming with me to Trader Joe's? No, I have volleyball soon. I have to leave in so like 30 like minutes. Oh. Yeah, I have to, it's 40 minutes away. It's 40 minutes away. Where is it? Williamsburg. Quick nap for volleyball? Wee oui, wee. Oui. Wee oui, wee. Oui. Cozy fit for Trader Joe's. Five floors up, five floors down. So these are all the items that I got. Crackers, and I still have some crackers. They're up there somewhere. Pretzel crackers and whatnot. Some dried mangoes. Obviously cheese. Like what's a charcuterie board without cheese? So we have brie here. We have some Wisconsin mild cheddar cheese. And this is Monterey Jack cheese. Then three different kind of meats. I got prosciutto. Then this is um, salami. Some grapes. We got dill pickles. Olives. These are a lot of olives, but they should be good. So at work we had the fun little Thanksgiving party potluck and I made my charcuterie board. Insert clip here. There were a lot of leftovers. We didn't finish like any of the food. There was a huge turkey. We didn't finish that either. Um, we went to the Apple store and we picked up a new iPhone. This is the iPhone 14 Plus in the color Starlight, which is the white one. Um, 256 gigabytes. This is for my mom for her Christmas present because she's still using, I think she's using like an iPhone 6 or something like that, like iPhone 6 Plus. Useless. So we're getting her a new phone. That also means that she can send better quality videos of my dog to our group chat. It's a win-win. Okay, all ready to go. We're going to our friend's housewarming party. So I just popped on some lashes and then, um, I'm just wearing, these are old navy jeans, which are fantastic. Busted out the, the black puffer. This scarf is from Oakenfort. This guy's in his Canada Goose. He's ready to brave the cold. Oh, what is that? Always prepped with some sparkling water. Currently on the hunt for a pack of beer. Six packs Six of beer. Six pack of beer to bring to the housewarming. And uh, should have planned ahead, but here we are scrambling. But look at this! The giant bowls! They're here every year. And with the really pretty lights on the side. This is like an yeah, after hungry. drinking activity. Cowboy bike. <laughs> Hey, let's go! Yo, let's go! Yo, I guarantee my vlog will be 10 times better than Alicia's, yo. And if it's not even a question, yo, it's gonna be waste, it's gonna be trash. He won't support me on my own Nah, my food is gonna be elite. Tasty nice time in the flesh, yo. Look at that. Current situation. So cold. So cold outside. <laughs> Solid is this place. My man oh, Ray Fu said, I'd be said down. So, so solid. solid. So solid. So solid. Okay, so this line is worth it. It's worth it. It's worth the cold. Triage might not be able to enjoy anything, but let me show you. Let me let me show you how cold it is right now. He's a real friend. Yeah, I'm a W friend. Right. W friend. W in the chat. Really? Triage being an elite friend. This is this is chaotic. It's not warm enough. It's not cold enough. Look at that socks. 3.07 a.m. We finally made it home. I waited until we got home to try the Adele's famous 
halal food from their food truck. We were waiting outside for so long, so cold. My prediction is that this is probably going to be the same as what halal guys was like five years ago. It was really good before, but apparently this is the new spot. There's so much halal food in the city. I feel like the local Ooh. halal trucks are just as good. Mm. I don't know. Oh, wow. Is it good? So in Australia, they have something called an HSP. It's called a halal snack pack. I think, hands down, that is actually like better than, this. than most of the halal food you get in New York City. It's pretty good. Okay. Right now it's currently 11.34. I am exhausted. But I'm meeting my friend Julia today and her boyfriend Sam to get Robin. Okay, so this is the fit. Just something simple. Um, hair is still drying, but just a striped shirt um, from Zara. And these are just like some flare black pants. I'm just gonna wear like sneakers or something. Maybe the so good. kitchen fixes pretty quickly. It seems like they're making good food. I know. Wait, sorry, so well, what is the story of the band-aid again? So she was just wagging her tail like this against like the wall, like the metal like wire thing. And yeah. it just like, she like hit it and it probably had like a scab and it like, oh my just goodness. started bleeding. Oh. <gasps> she likes kisses. Oh. Yeah. That was so fun. We just finished playing with Star. She's such a cutie. We're headed to get some bubble tea. Even though it's like so cold outside, I'm probably just gonna get like a like a hot tea. And Jason wants to go to Dr. Martin, so check out some Black Friday deals for their boots. I want to uh, figure out my sizing first, so that this Black Friday I know exactly what I want, yeah. and then uh, snatch it up. Snatch it up. Okay, this is the taste test. I've actually never had a hot one, and I'm scared I'm gonna burn myself from the straw. You know. Oh, it was so hot. I need to let it cool down. Oh, that's hot. See, I told you, how am I supposed to drink it? Woo. So this caterpillar looking thing has been here like, it comes like sporadically. It's like sometimes yeah, it's here, sometimes good. not. Okay. Out of five, what are the odds you go in? So if I get the number eight, you have to go in. Three, two, two one, five. three. What did you say? Five. Oh, fuck. I actually like these ones. Yeah, these. These I actually was thinking about maybe getting a pair like these, but even but don't, you have, don't you have blundstones? I do, but I have. They're like this, and they're so old now. Honestly. Wait, but are your blundstones? I thought they were brown. They are black. I like this. Yeah. Wait, they already look so good. I need to know why I've never discovered that there's four floors in here. It's so big, and they have like the cutest boots. Like, huh? Cute, all of these boots. They do have it. Well, here, how much is it? How much is it here? 126. 126, and how much There's was it? 170. At wow. Doc Martin, and they the girl at Doc Martin said, yeah, they said they don't price match. So we just wanted to come here to check it out because might as well. Because if it's the same shoe, might as well no, get like it, it for cheaper. It looks good. The stitching is yeah, all good. It's good. Honestly, I don't think I need to try it on, but. Just double check it, yeah. No, it looks amazing. Me in a shoe. I need this. It's so cute. So we just got home. We went to Target on our way back because we were looking for like string Christmas lights. Um, they're like mini twinkling lights and I just thought it's kind of short so I, like we're probably just gonna put it like on this TV stand thing. So the Christmas lights are all set up and they look so good. So Target literally has the best Christmas decor. They just like, everything's so affordable. I might get like some stockings um, just to hang on the TV stand. So I feel like this is just like the low, my low effort 
Christmas decor because we're not actually spending Christmas in the city. This is a cute addition. I'm happy. 